Hello everyone, you may notice I'm not really using my Mac right now because I am going to talk about a little bit about this game, Super Mario 3D World. I'm also I'm also going to review this as well, but I'm not like, I can actually review the Wii U version because this is the scratchy one. But then a few years later, it actually got remade into the Switch version. Bowser's Fury. Anyway, um, let's just get into this. So in my opinion, out of 3D Land, I honestly love 3D World. Like, it's been like seven years since I played this because I beat this entire game just before it got broken. Like, like the disc is scratched. Anyway, let's get on with the footage. So the whole story is in this game, Mario and friends are walking alongside Peach's castle, walking down a nice night. Then they spot a huge giant pipe. Sorry, I'm just trying to get ready for this. So they find the pipe, Mario and Luigi fix it, and they spot this little fairy thing, and then, oh no, her friends have been taken by Bowser, and then all of a sudden, BAM, it's Bowser. Then she kidnaps the little fairy, then Mario and Luigi, Toad, well, Blue Toad, Peach, go down the pipe, and now they have to do all they can to go into these new worlds that you that you get to play through. And I even have the, I, I even got this cool plush yesterday, okay, not yesterday, Friday from GameStop. Sorry, I'm just I'm just still trying to wake up. Also, if you may notice, it's very snowy outside. Also, I want to show you that really quickly. Okay, I know this has nothing to do with the video, but I just wanted to show you guys. It, like, literally snowed out. And there's a chance I might go back to online school in a little bit, which sucks, because online school sucks. But the good thing for me is I better have a new setup, so 3D printing. Wait, why am I even doing this? Sorry, guys. I need to get back to the review. Anyway, um, about Bowser's Fury. So the whole story is Bowser Jr. is in serious trouble because Mario and so Mario and Jr. have to team up to actually fight Bowser because Bowser has gone on a serious rampage for some reason. And then the cool thing about this is that Mario not only goes into cat form, but he also goes into super ultra mega cat form called Giga Cat Mario. And it's only a matter of cat shines that you need to collect throughout the game in order to unlock each and every giant cat shine bell and yeah so i honestly recommend this game like a lot since that one i mean like i it's been a while since i played this game but i would recommend that you video game nerds out there you would buy this game this is like really fun i'm really i'm really like playing the 3d world version right now and I'm playing also Bowser Fury. I'm kind of stuck on the snow levels. Spoiler. On the snow levels where I'm trying to get the blue, um, the blue coins for that. Fine. It's a good thing I found footage for that because, I mean, this game's, this game is brand new. And if I try to edit this, I, I would assume that there would be no gameplay footage of this, like, at all. Like, for Bowser's Fury. But thank gosh it did. Anyway. So yeah, also if you noticed yesterday, I did post a short video about Charles Martin and Mario. So make sure you go watch that. Also, thank you guys so much for watching. I know this is like a really short video as well. But hey, it's a review. I finally did it. And yeah, I will see you all in the next video. Bye.